For the Interrobang, I'm Johan George. This week we interviewed students from the Graphic Design Program at Fanshawe College. Gary Hopkins is a graphic designer at the Fanshawe Student Union and a second year graphic design student at the college. He designs posters for the FSU and is hoping to join a graphic design firm in London in the future. Brianna Brizette is a graphic designer at the Fanshawe Student Union and a third year graphic design student. She manages her website Bri Art Studio where she does freelance work and designs many of the posters around campus. So I just, I like doing art and I liked exploring the creativity. So I tried something new to be completely honest with you and it just ended up being what I loved. It was important for me because uh, I've already tried out college. I was at Fanshawe uh, straight out of high school. Um, and it was important for me to find something that I was going to love and I could also have growth in. Um, so definitely getting into the art and technology, mixing those two together was um, one of the main reasons and passion uh, for sure is one of the biggest ones for me too. Originally I actually started as a business student here at Fanshawe and I kind of finished that and I, I realized you know I, I enjoyed the business program here but I kind of wanted to pick, kind of explore more uh, creative side of things so I, I, I uh, landed on graphic design. It's kind of a meld between business and like arts so it's kind of right in the middle so I get to be creative on a daily basis but I also get to focus on like things like marketing and stuff like that. Uh, so far, I have absolutely nothing bad to say about the program. Uh, both the students and uh, faculty has been amazing just to work with. Even during online and COVID, it's just been um, a really, really good environment to, to be in. Uh, because we have been online, I haven't been too much in person yet, uh, but there has been moments and times where we share uh, just stories we've seen in London or talk about certain logos, uh, a rebranding of a logo and just get to talk to people who understand and can kind of have a good laugh about it and yeah. What I think makes it well-rounded is the quality of the professors, like they're all like very successful in their field and they kind of have a lot of experience in their field. And it's also a very community oriented school. I feel like you don't get that a lot with other schools. Like Fanshawe has like, obviously the student unions is a big part of it. And the events that we put on, it's just like kind of, it's kind of it feels more like a community rather than like a school. Yeah. Honestly, meeting the professors for the first time is always a, like an amazing experience. And specifically um, one of my professors, Tim, meeting him for the first time was probably my favorite experience so far. He's just such an outgoing guy and he, you can tell he really loves the program and really loves teaching and he, he only teaches first years so he kind of is everyone's first really like um, kind of that's how they get introduced to the program and I think he does a really great job of that so yeah shout out to Tim that's my he's my favorite memory for sure. For graphic design I think the biggest one for me has become organization. It doesn't sound like it, but you will have a lot of files. Even at the end of first year, you'll lose files. You'll have to restart projects. Just, yeah, I feel like that's one of the biggest ones that people don't think about. Um, but yeah, organize your files, keep your work, uh, definitely for future uh, references and just for you to look at your growth as an artist, it's, uh, I think it's really important. I feel like you have to be very self-motivated. It's kind of, you're kind of on your own. There's not a lot of group work like in business. You're kind of just, it's you and the professor and you're just going back and forth. All the marks are very individual based and you, there's no schedule for your projects. It's just, you got to complete them on your own time and you got to figure out how to manage that time effectively. And a lot of the students in the program as well have jobs on the side. So it's, it, it kind of gets you into the work-life balance right away. So if you're not prepared for that, you're gonna definitely struggle in the program. What I would say to future graphic design students is take every moment you can to talk with your professors and your fellow classmates and just kind of really enjoy the experience of being all together and you know bounce ideas off each other because that's like a really big part of it too is a lot of the learning happens in the classroom but a lot of the learning happens outside the classroom too when you're just 
talking with friends and stuff like that. So I would say, you know, get to know as many people as possible, make those connections and yeah, just have fun with it. I think within the graphic design program, anyone looking to kind of spark their creativity or kind of figure out what exactly they want to do, um, even moving forward in the technology space, in the art space, business, uh, I feel like graphic design works for a lot of different areas and you can use it um, to have fun as well, which is even better for anyone looking to be creative or even spark your um, inspiration of creativity. Start there, look around. Uh, there's lots of things within that. You'll do illustration and some other kind of hands-on projects. So even if you don't end up staying in graphic design, you'll definitely learn something and um, have it for the rest of your life. Graphic design is a program that teaches students how to communicate ideas in multimedia with a combination of theory, history, and industry best practices. Students have lots of opportunities and work experience at the college and different organizations across London. For the Interrobang, I'm Johan George.